Welcome to an end of day strategy for trading binary options. This topic is brought to you by binaryoptions.net.au. Did you know, statistically and on average, low frequency traders such as end of day traders return more money over the long period than high frequency traders such as intraday traders? End of day trading, also known as position trading, occurs when a binary options trader identifies a high probability trade setup on an end of day price chart and places a buy, call or sell, put position the very next trading day. As opposed to intraday trading whereby traders place trades in a higher frequency, i.e. more often throughout the day, an end of day trader places trades less frequently. Further, unlike intraday traders who use tick or minute data, end of day trading signals are generated off the daily price bar after the trading day has closed. So when we say end of day, whose end of day do we mean? Officially, the end of day refers to 1700 hours New York time. That is, a daily candle will always close and open with the New York trading session close and open. For local markets, however, the end of day candle will close and open in line with the local exchange trading session times. Why are end of day strategies so popular? Because of the work life balance the strategy and setup affords. Many end of day traders manage full time jobs and this type of strategy is considered less arduous and demanding, allowing traders to fit their trading activities around a normal work schedule. End of day setups, because of their higher time frames, are often considered stronger and more reliable, reducing trading noise often seen on shorter time frames. Plus trading and data feed costs are smaller, where applicable. In fact, in most cases, end of day data is free. For end of day traders, time constraints is not an added pressure for decision making, which it is when using one minute price bars for example, often counterproductive. There are many end of day strategies that traders can experiment with, including ADX, trading hours, trading the trend and end of day gap breakouts. In this example, we will focus on using an inside day Bollinger Band turn trade. First, let's examine Bollinger Bands, one of the world's most popular trading indicators. Bollinger Bands consist of a center line and two price channel bands above and below it. The center line is an exponential moving average. The price channels are the standard deviations of the stock. The bands will expand and contract as the price action of a stock becomes volatile, known as an expansion, or becomes bound into a tight trading pattern during contraction. When trading Bollinger Bands as a strategy, prices approaching the upper Bollinger Band are considered high while prices nearing the lower Bollinger Band are considered low. Traders often buy and sell when price breaks these key indicator levels. However, strong trends will often ride out the breach of the upper or lower band, rendering the trade a loss. Because Bollinger Band indicator strategy states that when price makes new highs in an uptrend and new lows in a downtrend, price will bounce and break the upper or lower band. To generate a high probability setup, binary option traders must filter the trading signals generated by Bollinger Band by adding a confirmation function, in this case an inside day. An inside day occurs when the first day in the two day pattern has a wider trading range than the second. An inside day is often used to signal indecision because neither the bulls nor the bears are able to send the price beyond the range of the previous day. If an inside day is found at the end of a prolonged downtrend, 
and is located near a level of support, it can be used to signal a bullish shift in trend. Conversely, an inside day found near the end of a prolonged uptrend may suggest that the rally is exhausted and is likely to reverse. Statistically, an inside day occurs approximately 10% of trading days. So how do we trade the inside day Bollinger Band turn trade? Using a daily price bar and daily expiry at minimum, binary traders should place a call or put trade only when the price candle following the one that breaks through the upper or lower Bollinger Band does not make a new high or low, shown as an inside day. This offers binary option traders the best opportunity for their trade to expire in the money using this strategy. By doing this, traders are increasing the probability that prices have hit extreme levels and a reversal is imminent. Furthermore, as an end of day trader, the longer the time frame, the more significant the reversal will be. Because binary options traders are not concerned with how much an asset moves in price, only the direction, it is important to confirm the Bollinger Band reversal points with the inside day pattern. For more information about this topic and more binary options trading strategies, please visit binaryoptions.net.au.